Greetings and welcome back to Sweet Transit. I'm Catherine of Sky and we have a tiny problem. Just a teeny itty bitty tiny itty bitty problem. Uh, that would be that I made a mistake when I added this overpass here because um, so I had a I had a look at see how long it would take to get into positive numbers here. And the major problem is that because we have three tiles here that are next to a straight track, the trains try to unload here. So you get this uh, thing. So this one is supposed to be going to Tulinga City but it thinks it's already been there because it's been nearby this platform. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to alter this platform. Now we can alter the railroad, but we don't have enough money to alter the railroad. So I think the best solution for us at this point, can, can we actually get this on a loan maybe? No, let's see. Can we get here? Eh. Wait, am I, am I not doing the UI correctly? Hold on. Yep. Eh? Like the, uh, 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 eh, like that. Yeah, I can't buy it. All right. So let's, let's, what, let's do a thing here. Let's delete these pieces of platform. So it doesn't think this is a station because one piece of platform does not make a station. It has to be three. And apparently I missed that in the tutorial. Um, and and that'll give us a short platform, but it should be long enough to take almost all of the trains or all of them, in fact. So let's see, we're going to have you go back here. Uh, and that was causing some issues with stuff. Okay. So that was a big one. Um, there was another thing that I can't remember, but that was causing many of our trains to have the issue of thinking they stopped and they didn't actually do that. So, um, we also had a tiny issue of, um, where the trains were stopping. That one's still shop stopping short on the platform. I don't understand that. Uh, why are they doing this? Let's take a screenshot of this. Um, I was told it's because I had signals, but there are no signals on this platform. That's for sure. Anyway, um, so now I want to check on our trains again, because I did do a little bit of running it by itself. I did not save it. This is back. This is, this is where we actually left off in the last episode. Um, so we want to see, let's see, did we do the tool pass coal tool saw one pass tool, right? So this was the sawmill passenger train. Okay. That was the major one that we had running. Um, and hopefully we're going to be able to get some of this going. Now, do we need this many trains running at the moment? Some, some, someone said to me, this is so interesting. Um, you don't need that many trains. I had such a bigger base and I had fewer trains and I'm like, well, you do realize that I'm adding trains because I'm not getting enough of what I need. That's the reason the trains were added. Like, hello. <laughs> like, I just, I, I just don't get it. I don't get it. And it had to do with the wood. We didn't have enough wood. Okay. So let's go ahead and send this one to the depot because I'd rather have other trains around. Let's go with this many trains and how many are at the depot right now? We have one, two, three, four, like five of them here. I don't think we pay on any of those trains there because they're not in service. So we don't have to pay maintenance or anything. Okay. So there we go. Oh, wait, are they stopping at the platform here and then stopping at the signal? Oh, that's what they're doing. Okay. never mind. So they're stopping at the platform and then at the signal. All right. Gotcha. 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 So anyway, we are earning money, right? Or well, we were, <laughs> we were earning money. Um, somebody also suggested that having too many 
buildings in the cities might be a culprit for cost. The storage is only cost 50 money. That's it. Um, I guess we could get rid of a couple of them anyway. We could. I mean, let's see. How many storages do we have? There is one there. So let's go and just take these off. Um, there are enough here. I don't know how they really function, if they actually store stuff inside them or what. But anyway. Um, let's see. Stoneworks is here. We have several Stoneworks buildings. There's four of them at 100 apiece. We could take a few of those off, or we could just let them make stone. Stone is always good. Ah, we're making money now. We're making a lot of money now. Boom. We made it. Okay. Okay, we are not suffering anymore. And that means we can actually get this thing organized better when we have a situation like this where we can actually... Uh, do things so let's see we had one two maybe this counted as the third one i don't know but i'm going to just delete signals and let's delete that one as well just delete this entire thing i guess we can delete that there okay that's fine so let's just add this night this way, please. Good, good. Okay, so now let's just go as well as possible there. Let's uh, delete the signal as well. And maybe that one too. So here we'll just do like this. So there's no chance of this being thought of as a platform by the trains. Um, we're going to go ahead and do a crossing uh, chain signal there. Chain signal here. Uh, there's also another cross here, so chain signal there. And we don't want any of these standing across the line, so we'll leave that as a chain signal and wait. they can wait behind those cars there. Uh, I feel like we deleted a lot more signals than we're adding, but that's just fine. It doesn't matter uh, as long as we get it correct. That's all that matters. So let's get back to our platforms and have proper platforms all the way along. And no trains will think of this section as being, uh, yeah, wrong. Okay, and we're getting wood now, finally. Thank goodness. We need to get a little bit... Okay, the trains are also... Whoa, 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 whoa. What happened here? Hello, hello, what? Hello? Hello? <gasps> no, of course. Ah, uh, that comes from too much playing too much playing games all right uh too much playing victoria i was just playing victoria where i am having a right hand drive system so of course i forgot that we are driving on the left here but we fixed it we didn't die we fixed it all and now the trains are quite happy to do all the things and all the stuff all right this one is getting cotton perfect or not where are you going hello what oh you're doing sawmill one. Oh, that was weird okay Oh, we also have a new problem. New problem. New problem. All right, we forgot to add a uh, turnoff here. Let's go here that way. Yes, there we go. That's just fine now. Good, good. Okay, right. So now we got that sorted. Happy days. All right, this is much better. We are still earning money, which is good. Not anymore. <laughs> It'll get there. It'll get there. It'll get there. It'll be fine. Okay, so we were actually thinking about... Did we have enough coal? That is a good question. So apparently there is a button... Oh, God. People are like... Oh, yeah, there's a button that says all. This all? Oh, that all. Maybe that's the all. This is that. All is all. Okay, fine. So we are getting 9 of 25. 9 of 250, I mean. That's not good. Um, and apparently there is actually a blueprint button, which I uh, will investigate shortly. I think we should uh, add to Linga Station, this secondary station here. There is a new update coming out that... When you add a station platform, it actually increases the length of 
the uh, or the something of the station the aoe of the station that seems cool i don't know when that update is coming out though i uh, so there's also a way you can make a blueprint it is this thing that looks like a bee made out of tracks and stuff so we're going to use that to make stations for ourselves we're going to just going to kind of kind of grip this whole thing does it give us everything it does that's quite nice okay can i put it here no why not hello save no okay sorry that was something oh goodness i think i didn't see it because it's such a weird color in the whole color scheme of things i just i literally didn't even see it so let's rotate can i rotate this please hello Okay, E. Ah, there we go. There's the E. Okay. So if we put this here, so we need to delete this section there. Let's try that. We need to just delete this whole entire thing. Yes. Destroy. Thank you. The whole thing. Yes, I really mean it. I promise you I mean it. I'm in a mood. So, is it control C? Does that work? No. I wish that hotkey was available from Factorio. That would have been nice. Uh, all right. Let's copy this. Again, QE is to rotate. I wish R was for rotate because I'm very good at R. I'm not very good at this QE business. Okay, this also, those also need to be rotated. Q also does not work as one would expect. Okay, let's try it again. Yeah, and saving the blueprint would be kind of amazing. I hope we get savable blueprints soon. So, I don't know. Maybe there's a way to save it, and I just don't know what it is. I don't see anything else on the UI that says, hey, save blueprint here. Uh, I could be missing it, though. That could very well be. Okay, this needs 21,000 monies, which we don't have yet. Well, crap. Uh, that's not ideal. Why are we down 5,000 again? What? Why? Uh, not just from removing. Okay, let's get some water towers and junk in this place. Maybe they'll be a tiny bit happier. Okay, they also want a market. I think we can put the market back here if we move it to the side, potentially. Oh, we have no money. Okay, or no, I think we had no lumber there for a second. Okay. But the coals, the coals, the trains are filled with coal right now. That's great. Looking pretty good. We have a lot of wood. Um, production is too low. Zero and upkeep 181. Eh. We don't really believe that now, do we? No, of course not. Okay, let's go. Come on, come on. Build up the town. Let's get going again. We can do this. We're 2,200 laborers. Kind of tempted to start another city, but it feels very dangerous to do so. But only just to have like sort of a backup income of like a maybe a basic economy or something like that. But I do feel like we could improve stuff if we add the potatoes and the cotton to this side of things but again we need 21,000 money to make that happen that's a lot but I think it would be nice also um, a few people mentioned adding plants and stuff to the city like decorations which I seem to have lost access to environment yes can't wait do I maybe I do have them out over here yeah I do okay so they are here you can add I think the small parks were better benefit money wise okay or not okay add a money again okay you can actually change them a tiny bit
Getting the attractiveness up just tiny bits at a time here. Worship not in range. Okay, that's okay though. Not terribly worried about that. Oh, I thought this was rotating this, but it's actually just a different style of road. So it goes from straight to T-shaped to a uh, corner, and that's if you use the E, Q, and E buttons. Oh, no, wait. That was the R button. Ah, okay. There we go. That's cool. Very cool. Okay, so now we're getting getting some more money in, little bits at a time. Trying, we're trying. They can tell we're trying, I hope. Yeah, those cost 2,000 each. That's quite a lot of money. They do actually cost money to operate as well. There's are minus 40 per second, but uh, hoping that the added attractiveness will give us a little bit of a boost here. Okay, these have no station. Let's get going, people. Okay, here we go. We're, we're building up now, finally. How much does Cotton 1 have? We have a lot of cotton in the city or in, in the station. So we have shirts. Do we have potatoes? Let's find out what's going on with potato land. Potato land is at plenty of potatoes. We're just not getting them delivered for whatever reason. I'm wondering if I should have a, I want to track the passenger, uh, um, this one to the sawmills. Let's see all so if we, we have all, we only have 40 passengers that are fresh. I was thinking of having like one passenger train visit several stations, but I'm thinking that's maybe not really doable. It may be able to visit maybe two stations, but not more than that, I would think. Especially with these large stations that have multiple um, mills and stuff uh, there. Because it's going to the sawmill, which has... One, two, three only has, oh no, it has four. It has four different production buildings. So you really couldn't have one going to cotton and potatoes at the same time, I think. So let's see, let's see what we can do with stuff. We still need 21,000 to build this other station. All right, let's see. Keeping on going here. We're get, getting there, getting there. It's a bit bit rough I think okay that's nice so now we're at 0.7 those parks are really expensive much more expensive than I thought Okay, we're at one star of attractiveness. That's, I don't know if that's good or not good. I have no idea how much one needs for a city um, to be in happiness zone or whatever. So not quite sure, but I'm hoping we're going to improve this uh, wealth amount as we get access to more and more stuff like bread. Oh no, potatoes. Wow, okay. So now, we have quite a lot of people having stuff and we're nowhere near the amounts of money we were making. I'm really surprised by that. I don't know why that is doing that. Okay. 
Yeah, 25 of 25. And it doesn't seem like we have... I don't know, the whole... Nothing to unlock. I thought there was something to unlock, wasn't there? Not enough workers. Okay. It's at the quarry. Hmm. The station range, not enough fuel. There's only two trains with not enough fuel, so that's good. Efficiency is below 100%. We're getting to see some of those buildings. Cotton. Looks like potatoes. More cotton. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why the amount of money is so low here. Um, what we could do is we could try to just go to the depot and sell these things. Let's see if that puts us lower on those. So trains are only at 1360. Okay. Let's just delete some of these. One. Okay. Did that help us at all? No. So if it's at the depot, I think that means that they are effectively paused. And so we shouldn't have gotten rid of them because we basically, well, we actually have a lot of money now. So that's a good thing. Um, manufactories are also deleting a lot of money. Um, and I'm wondering if that's basically these things. This is costing us minus 50. Minus 50. 50 and 50. So 1, 2, 3, 4. So that's 200. Where are this, where is this 5,000 coming from? That seems massive. These are 250. So this is 1,000. So it must be these. I'm thinking, why don't we go ahead and delete some of these? Because I, I think that we might be uh, overspending on these a lot. So that is manufactories 5,050. Uh, okay. Let's see, how is Potato Land doing? They have more than enough potatoes. This is 100 only. These are also 100. How about the cotton plants? These are 1,000 each? <gasps> wow, okay. All right, let's find out where this money goes. Let's see. Manufactories are... 5,000. So if we delete one of these at 1,000 each. Yes, these are manufactories. Okay. Uh, let's destroy a second cotton farm to get our money up, 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 up. Let's go ahead and copy the train station now and see if we can put this in. That'll be nice. Let's rotate this like this. That is perfect. Oh, I was going to move it down to. Uh, do I care? Not really. Not really. Not really. We'll leave it like this because that's an easier entry anyway. Anyway, let's just chill and kill these rail rails here. So, how do we want to have this proceeding? Let's see. I think these are going to come out this way. So, I think if we put in the entrance here, that might create less traffic, potentially. So, let's do that. Okay. And then here, we're going to have a chain signal, choosing signal for choosing the path. And then, uh, also, we can we need to do a path on the other side as well, of course. And that is completely right. Confusion. Oh, that's right, because these are on the opposite side, because we did a little bit of a funny thing here. Right, okay, so these go to here. All right, so out is going to be going this way. And in, out this way is going to go that way. So go ahead and put our chain signal here and there. We don't want it to block the traffic. There we go. So Tulinga 
uh, we'll just call this, uh, Tlingo, uh, Okay, Tlingo Sodra, south. Mm. Um, and we're going to convert a couple of these lines that way, right? So let's go and find the ones that we want to move, which is cotton. So instead of Tulinga City, we're going to go to Tulinga Sudra. Reselect destination to you. Okay. And, oh, this is easy. This is fantastic. Yes. Okay. Right. Cotton and then potatoes. So that these are not even going to mess with any of that stuff here. So let's go ahead and go here again. Uh, yep. Go there for all of your working needs and dropping off needs let's go let's go perfect okay so here's our first customer looks good dropping off things are happening good stuff we have people we have things we have stuff this is fantastic all right very good very very good workers workers good 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 we ran out of workers but overall, this is going to be a lot less uh, trouble with stuff. This, oh god, that's not good. I need to fix that. Let's see, if I click on, oh, that's right. These are not platforms. Okay, so let's click on this. Get some more track. Okay, that's fine. But I believe we do not have coal here. So we do want to take... We want to get a train here to get coal. Now, the the drive distance from Tulinga Sodra to cotton or potatoes is very short. So I'm not going to worry about it too much. Uh, what I want to do is actually create a new station to collect coal. So in that vein, um, I am going to... What do we want to do here with this? I think we actually need to do magic of a kind and i'm not really sure how that works let's see we'll do a coal mine here and i'm not sure if we can do like a let's see if i click on the platformy bits and do i think we need an actual road and to do a road we can get a distribution centery thingy uh that doesn't work does it nope it does not well let's see let, let me just try another thing hold on a second let's see if we do something like this okay and create because these, these, these over, over passery thingy, thingy majingies, yes, that, those are words. Mm -hmm, I am using words. Um, we can't do that, can we? No, of course not. Why would we be able to do something so useful? Hmm? Yeah, right. Okay. This does not want to work. Okay, now it works. Okay, so this is not going to be a an option for here, I think. So that means we're going to need to get another station out here. And then we can create stuff, okay? So if we click on making a distribution center... Uh, oh, yes, we can do it this way. Of course we can. Yes, why would we not be able to do this? Hello? Oh, planks. We need... We need... Planky planks. Planky planks. So also, just so you know, we have not had too much trouble with the trains. Basically, the problem was with having many, many of these things. So what are we doing right now with... Do we have enough shirts? We do. We have enough cotton and enough shirts. So make sure <laughs> that you don't overdo your stuff. I really didn't have any idea that these cotton farms were so darn expensive compared to the other farms. That's a bit crazy, I think. So, all right. So what do we need now? We have... We're plus 3,000 almost. We're doing really well. Train depots, manufactories, stations, 
trains. So I do want to get another train or seven for wood. We have not enough wood. So we're going to add a train to the queue here, which is going to be our saw where which we want to take off the passenger wagon we don't need that remove and instead put in another flat wagon again we're at 10.6 of 11 um so we're wanting to build two of those or so to go on to the uh tool saw where it's actually not tool saw it's just saw where but let's build two of those Okay, we want to upgrade the root, which is tool saw wear. Match this one to a new one of this one. Yes, that is exactly what we want. Will cost us a lot of stuff. It's fine though. Um, let's rename that one. The tool saw wear to just wear saw wear. Okay, that's good. We don't want to be confused, so that is perfect. Getting things a little bit better. Done. We didn't... Okay, so produce fish per minute. Reach a population of laborers. We probably need to build another city for that, I'm thinking. Um... We could start having a look and see. Ah, look at this. We have a lot more wood now. This is fantastic. Okay, so we have warehouses, stations, manufacturers, train depots, balance, wealth, capacity. We're doing well. We're doing well. And those are our thingy-majingies. There's our one city, our trains. Now, what is next to do here? Oh, we were going to, oh yeah, of course we were going to build this uh, station. I forgot. Let's, let's do that right now because we want to build the distribution center. We, we were a little bit lacking because we didn't have the stuff things. And then we wanted to build a couple of little uh, thingy thingies. There we go. We'll do this instead. Get rid of this one. And add a road here and a road there and that should be connected I think to the coal mine okay yes it is perfect now then let's build a train station here and we're going to build a platform this way and I think that should be plenty enough uh, oh did I do that right yes I did okay I had a confusion there for a moment. Just a tiny one. It's fine though. It's fine though. It's fine, fine. Yes, and we will build more stuff, more things. Let's just copy this. Uh, no, we can't copy with that. Of course not. Why would we be able to do that? Uh, we just want this amount. Four tracks is enough. Whoa, why did it copy all that? Did I make a mistake? I might have. Might have gone way too far with my cursor there uh okay let's just copy these yes that's why i really wish we could just copy paste these things into a file which would be a lot more handy um okay let's do that okay we don't want to do this at all uh you know what we could do we could try to delete this thing and find out if a road will connect a distribution center to a station. Wait, why did it delete this entire platform? Eh? Why? Thingy? Behave! Okay, let's try the road thingy thing. Can we connect that that way? Station 9. Ah, it is connected. Okay, so you can connect a distribution center by a road. There was some contention on the Discord uh, yesterday uh, in the uh, dev Discord about whether you could connect those together. And that was, seems to be... I'm glad we figured that out because, yeah. Hmm. 
All right, so let's see. I don't want this to happen. I think we need to remove things like signals and stuff like there. Yes, and we actually need to remove these tracks here as well because it's going the wrong direction. Okay, no, bad. What the heck? I just want to click and drag a box around these and just do the whole thing. Why does it not let me do this? It's being mean. Yeah. Yeah. Mean. Hmm. Right. Okay. Let's get a platform here. Hello. Platform, please. Platform, please. Please. Thank you. Okay. Great. So this station... Uh, mm, what do we want to do with this, actually? So this, this is going the wrong way. But what we can do is just remove them, remove these bits and have them go the correct way. And this could be kind of our way of just having a way out here to the uh, other line. Since that isn't a main line, it's, well, it's a sort of a main line. Uh, but it isn't like the double tracked main line. So let's see. Can we do a thing here where no? The answer is no. So we're going to do this differently. I'm going to do something like this. Yes. Okay. Do something really squiggly there. Absolutely. These are the in signals and these are out. Night. Whoops. Stop that. Stop that. Okay. Now, uh, we have, let's have that signal there. This looks good. Um, we need a choosing signal. There we go. And then we take this and try to connect it with these lines here. So this one will go that way. And this one will come in that way. So again, we'll signal this properly. Always a chain signal before the crossing. And then a regular signal after the crossing to close off that block. Uh, looking pretty good here. So this is going to be, we're going to call this coal 2 or coal mine 2. Okay. And what we're going to do is we're going to set up a do we have enough people how many are in tulinga city All right, i think what we're going to do is take the pass take the workers from tulinga city because there are a little bit more there and we're going to ship them to coal mine two okay um how many no we don't need to do that do we we just need to do a train from Tulinga Sudra to Coal Mine 2 to get some coal to fill up the coffers here. Because I don't think... Do we actually have coal here? We do? Wow! Huh. Okay, so they're getting coal from the other station. That's perfect. So, alright. What we want to do is let's take a, a train from Tulinga City um yeah and just send them passengers to the other one yeah this coal mine one this is really not working at all well let's see let's see two tool pass coal yeah we only need one of those where coal, where coal. We only need definitely only one of those. You go to the warehouse, please. Uh, send to train depot. Okay. Are there any more where coals? No. I don't think these can even make up. Well, that one has 197. That one has 250. Okay, so maybe it's two of these. And the other one's tool pass coal. Huh. Let's go and uh, look at that one. Tool pass coal one. So it looks like two of these trains. And then we have two other 
trains going to fill up the warehouse with coal, which definitely seems to be needed. Well, no, not actually needed, huh? All right, why don't we do a simple thing here? Can we copy this route? No. Why would we be able to do that? We need a copy button here, please. I really would like a copy button. Like, copy this route to a new route. That would be fantastic. Okay, so tool uh, TUS. Uh, no, maybe TLS. Sounds like a good one. TLS to... Um, Let's see, coal two, pa uh, pass, uh, pass coal. Okay, so we're gonna go here to Linga Sudra. We're going to swap workers. Okay, then we're going to again um, unload coal. Uh, unload. Okay, then we go to coal mine two. Okay, uh, load coal. Sounds good. Uh, coal mine two. Swap workers. Perfect. All right, so that's what we want. We're going to build a new train now to be on this line. Um, add train to queue. We're going to use the previous one that we have. Tool pass coal. This is the right one. We're going to add that to the new one and build it. Okay, so that one will go there. Someone was also meowing about, oh my god, it's so bad that they have to go through this station. No, it's not. Come on. It's not bad. It, it, it takes three seconds into a barely trafficked station. Silly people. I think some of the people who comment on my videos have never actually played a game like this before. And like, they have no idea what's important and what's not important. This is quite obvious to me that it's like, no, you don't actually know what you're talking about. Uh, okay, we have shirts happening. We might need to build another shirt manufactory. We do have a lot of cotton. Uh, we have a lot of potatoes, which is perfect. So let's go ahead and build another... Oh, God, the bells. <laughs> I love that sound. Jeez, I need to get a bell like that. Uh, sorry. <laughs> I get a tiny bit excited. Um, let's see. Um, nah, night, night. Clothing shop. Yes, that's what we want. Let's go. Let's build two more of those, since we definitely are not, uh, swimming with riches with that one. Let's see, those are 0 0.6, 0 0.06, 0 0.06. Uh, I guess it doesn't matter what we have here. Trees are fine. Trees are fine. Okay, trees, trees. Just adding in a tiny bit of uh, just decor for the town to have a happier attractiveness value. Okay, good, good. Now then, we could potentially now um, build another uh, town somewhere. I was thinking about building it around here with these uh, bricky stuffs. But we do need to find... I think we need to find a place with more coal. This place has a lot of coal in it. Here, not so much. Here, there's tons. There's less bricky stuff. But if we go to the left, we're going to not be on the correct line anymore. Unless I turn the... Uh, can I turn the camera here? I don't even know if I can. Uh, shift, no, no. Did I miss that part of the tutorial where you can turn the camera? Maybe you can't. Maybe it's isometric and it doesn't turn. I don't know. I, I might be just dumb here. Could be. Uh, Z, X, C, N, I, A, S, D, nope. Q and E is for turning objects. Uh, we'll pretend. How about that? We'll just pretend. Um... But if we go up the line, we will go up that way. Or if we go down this way, we can go down that way. Now, I believe we can have... I don't know how many more cities we can have at the moment. But it might be worth making one around this area. And we can have some brick production. There's a lot of clay out here and in the desert as well. But this is a good spot to uh, make things like uh, houses. Yeah, um, those are really good there. But this is this is prime farming land. So this this looks like quite quite nice. How much money? You know what? It doesn't even matter. We have more money than we ever need to. Okay, water. 
This is water. And it doesn't tell us if there's a speed difference between these. Let's let's just go with this. Here's one. Okay, that's going to cost us 16,000. Seems reasonable. Okay. Fantastic. Now, I did that on purpose to make two bridges. Um, we could do it with one, but I chose not to because I chose not to. Um, I like to have, well, the efficiency of two for one thing. So there is that. Okay, let's delete these bits and pieces here. Oh, but goodness me. All right, so we're going to stop right there. I've just noticed that we have no more time for today. I have to be really strict with the timing because I, I have another trip that I'm going on and I really need to make many, many videos. And if I go over too far, then it's going to be a bit of a disaster. So anyway, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other. And I'll see you next time. Wait.